probably tried the perceptual route and people have tried the objective route. And I don't doubt that there'll probably be as many who say, no, it's objective for me, it's speed and heart rate versus others who go, well, I just go off how it feels. Um, but I think it's easier for the latter to be dismissed as the wrong strategy because it seems simple. And it is simple. Like running, it should feel hard. Or running, it should feel moderate. It definitely shouldn't feel easy. It definitely shouldn't feel hard. That's, that's where I want you to stay. you kind of like, imagine you were paying for that as a service. You'd be like, who is this guy? Who is this coach? Is he just making it up? But then when you try and unpick, when you try and understand and un- unpick heart rate and running speed, that's easy. That's like complex systems or, or complicated systems, if you like, where, yes, there's you can figure out how heart rate responds to exercise intensity and how that determines things like cardiac output and then ultimately our our external output, which is speed. And we can map it all out and we can join nice dots and lines. Again, it's complicated, but it's all there. Whereas perception is a, is a complex system. We can't join straight lines and neat arrows. It's like a continually merging murky cloud of sort of interconnected phenomena that are not always linearly related and that they change on a day, but they're still all connected and they're kind of still all evolving around and, and moving. So then I'm like, okay, RPE might be simple on face value, but pull away what you see and try and understand it. Nah, that is that is like ridiculously difficult. In my opinion, more so than things like heart rate, lactate, ventilation, whatever, whatever, all, all these other things. They're they fit in the nice boxes. That's 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 easy. 